Just send the money. Save the lecture. You know, I commend celebrities last night for pitching together to help those devastated by storms in Texas and Florida in a spectacular star-studded telethon. But I thought it was called hand in hand and not hand with a finger. You're there to help. You're not there to hurt. That goes for you too, Stevie Wonder, when you kicked off the show saying that anyone who believes that there's no such thing as global warming must be blind or unintelligent. Did you really think that maybe some of the people you're ostensibly trying to help are of that opinion? Are they blind? And given the fact that both Texas and Florida went for Donald Trump, of whom you're clearly not a fan, does that make them unintelligent? Talk about biting the hand you say you want to feed. Leaving aside, we've gone through, what, a dozen years without anything approaching the severity of these storms. Could you focus on raising some change and not lecture anyone about climate change? You're mocking a lot of the very folks you claim you want to help. So help them. Don't preach them. All I know is that they're at a loss because everything they have is gone. Why can't you just shut up then and help? And in your case, Beyonce, why can't you just sing? You know, God gave you a beautiful voice. Save the not so beautiful lecture. Spare the snide asides about watching violence and racism in this country. Focus on how maybe these tragedies and neighbor helping neighbors spoke to the better angels in this country. Doesn't look like a lot of racists there. You're doing good. You're raising millions. Leave it at that and only that. And most from Justin Timberlake and Julia Roberts to Ray Romano and Brian Cranston, they did that. Now, I don't know their politics. I don't care. But I thought this night wasn't really about politics. I thought it was about people, people helping people. I thought wrong. Never mind, we haven't seen anything like these back-to-back -back storms. Like I said, in over a decade, there's a Beyonce linking climate change to a monsoon in India and an earthquake in Mexico that even some climate changers, well, thought was a bit of a stretch. No matter, in the end of the opening telethon, a good haul, better than $44 million. I hope and trust it gets to the people intended, people who need the help, they don't need the sermon, and not from all in Hollywood, just some, and not from all those listening and watching, I suspect barely any. I'm betting that most of the folks who were sending in money, they didn't send lectures with their checks, just their signature. They want to help, not harangue, lend a hand, not shove a finger. Many can't sing, they can't act, but they don't need a script to play a part. Most of them just get in a boat or knock at a door to see if there's anything at all they can do. Sometimes they don't have to say a thing, but their quiet decency is deafening. You see, Hollywood, that is the thing about goodness. Sometimes it speaks the loudest when it's not speaking at all. Good night.